Hi, welcome to our Adobe Captivate 2019 training tutorials on new and advanced features. In this video we are going to see Fluid Boxes feature in Adobe Captivate 2019 release. So let's get started. As a first step, you need to add Fluid Boxes to the project. So, select Fluid Box in the toolbar, and choose horizontal or vertical boxes to your project as you required. The size of the box can be changed by dragging the blue arrows provided in between the boxes. As an alternative, you can change it in the Properties Inspector too. To do so, click on Properties. And select the Fluid Box. Then, select the Position tab. You can choose percentage or pixel from the drop down to change the size of the fluid box. You can also manually enter the height and width of the fluid box. Besides preview slider and device preview option, here you have an automatic device preview option to preview the content with a single click. Here you can see how the content automatically scales up and wrap up across the device sizes. There is a unique mechanism in the selection of fluid boxes. The orange color label box on the top left corner indicates parent fluid box. And below to that, the blue label indicates child fluid box. To select the parent fluid box you need to click on the orange label. The selected fluid box will have a blue outline and blue label on the top left corner and the same will be reflected in the properties panel. But when you hover over any fluid box, you can see a green outline, green highlight and green label of the respective box and vice versa. In the earlier version, you used to switch the tab for fill option, but in this version, you can fill the fluid box below to fluid box section. You can customize the flow of the content using the Content Flow option. Layout Preview option will be provided even in the Properties Inspector to check the flow of the content across the device sizes. In this slide, you can see different tabs with different sizes. And to align these three fluid boxes equally you have an option to distribute objects equally. When we click on this button, you can see the boxes distributed equally. In the previous version of Adobe Captivate, there was a default alignment for static fluid boxes, but in this updated version, you can customize horizontal and vertical alignment of static fluid boxes. Thank you for watching this video. For more information visit us at www.swift2learningservices.com.